Use the ball on the wall and smash up the glute area. This one's for your hip flexors. Get the ball and a kettlebell, push down, slowly release your leg down, and then move your leg in and out. The key for both of these exercises is to make sure you feel the pressure and the pain and you really try and work into those areas. Back with our trusty barbell, we're going to use it to work all through the quads, up and down. Pushing down hard. In this position, we want to work nice and aggressively through the adductors. Again, pushing down really hard and working out that tightness. This is for your hamstrings. Make sure you hold on to the bar and then work the hamstring on the edge of the barbell. Now we're going to move into some banded stretches. You want to set the band up just above the knee height and you can use a pad for your knee if you need to as well. Get the band nice and high in the hip, step back into a lunge, and then sink forward into that hip, squeezing your glute nice and tall through the posture. Second position from here, we're going to transfer to the inside of the foot and knee, pushing forward, stretching the short adductors. Now we want to work the hamstring, step forward, straighten out the back leg, and then bend all our weight over to that front leg. Another good hamstring one, take the front leg across the leg with the band, and then reach down, straight back leg again. Lastly for the hip and the glute, down into a 90, 90 position with the hip and pushing back, stretching through the hip, back of the hip. Spend about 20 to 30 seconds for each drill. If it's quite tight and sore, work it for longer. 